everyone and welcome to Poppy DIY Crafts. Today we're going to be making some hair clips. So I have this set of molds that was sent to me from Dutch Resin to review and these are used to make some hair claw clips. It comes with two sets of molds. These are identical and what's nice about it is that because you have two of them you can make both sides of the hair clip at the same time. In addition we also have six claw clips. So here we would just glue the little resin pieces on the back side when we're done. All right, so let's go ahead and get started. So let's just take a look at the molds. As you can see, there are six different shapes. We have two standard shapes. One's a mountain, one's a cloud, one's a flower, and one's a heart. So I think we should make each one of them different. I'm going to start with the mountain because this one has a little engraved portion where the snow is and so I'm going to be using some UV resin to fill in that portion. Here I have a Sophie and Toffee crystal art gel in white. Here I'm just moving it along to help fill in the crevices. When we're done, we're going to slide it under the UV lamp to cure. Okay, the snow is done. It has turned a little bit yellow, but I think it still looks okay. Next, let's work on the heart. So for the heart, I want to put these little silver hearts in them. And on the bottom layer, it's going to be clear. So once again, we're going to be using UV resin and then we'll add another layer on top. Let's go ahead and start with a thin layer of UV resin. I'm to do this to both sides. Spread it out. Okay, once all the hearts have been added, and then we're going to move the hearts in place. And then we are going to cure it. And the last one that we're going to do with UV resin is going to be the flower one. So we're going to fill the flower first with some clear UV resin. And in these, we are going to add some bright yellow sprinkles. So these are actually edible sprinkles, but once they're in the resin, they'll be sealed and it won't go bad. Next, I've gone ahead and mixed some regular resin. So this is regular two-part resin that will take a day to cure. And at this point, we are going to pour them into the other three molds. And once again, we can start decorating. So this one for the clouds, I got these really fun stars. We are just going to lay them in there. And the reason why I'm using two parts resin is because it's just a little bit less expensive than the UV resin. And so here we can save a little bit on the cost of supplies. I have a strand of little pebbles. These are so pretty. And so we're going to add them to this one. On this next one, I have some clay fillings. These are little clay charms. And these are really silly and cute. So I'm just going to put a few here. We have some tablets. Got some its rights. Super fun. Now back to the mountain. We're going to add some sapphire flakes and glitter. Oh, I think this is going to be so pretty. Look at this. Next, we have the heart, and I'm going to be using Fire Engine Red. Wow, this is so red. And 
and finally the flower. This one we're going to add more sprinkles. Alright everyone, so it's been a day and we are ready to demold. Oh my goodness, these look so good. So here's the pebble one. There is a bit of a texture here with the pebble sticking out. And on this side, it's completely smooth. Here's the other side. Oh, these look so good. This one's the cloud. Oh, look at the stars. Oh, super nice. I think these would look good with a white background too. Here is the tech one. This one's so cute. Oh wow, look how clean this is. Here's the flower, the sprinkles one. Oh, this one's still a little sticky in the back. You know, I'm going to run this under the UV light again. We'll just give it another minute or so. Okay, now it's a lot better. Next, we have the Dome Mountain. Oh, look at this. This one's really, really pretty. Here's the matching side. And here's the heart. Oh, look at that. Here's the second heart. So now what we're going to do is essentially glue the pieces to the hair clip like this. So you can use whatever glue you like. You can use scrap glue. Maybe you can even use glue gun. I'm going to be using some glue dots. So these are super strength and multi-use. Okay, so here's our first one. This is the heart. I think next time we actually want to make it so that they face the same direction. But I think this looks good too. This is so cool. Here I have my Isabella pony here. Let's go ahead. <laughs> and there we have it. Oh my goodness. This is super fun. Okay, so let's quickly assemble the other pieces. All right, everyone, and we are done. So let's take a look. Here is the flower sprinkles. This one is the pebble. I think this one is my favorite. I love the texture of the pebble sticking out. Here is the cloudy stars. Oh, this one looks so good. Here is the heart again. I think next time we need to make it mirror images so that they match. Here's the mountain. This one's super pretty. I just love the glitter. And here is the tech one. Look at this. <laughs> this one's really fun. All right, everyone. So what do you think of these hair clips? They were so much fun to make, and I love that you can really customize it and make it your own. So if you have a special outfit, you can make a special hair clip for it. So the links to this mold is down below in the description. And if you like this video, consider giving it a big thumbs up. Alright, see you next time. Bye!